Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. Today's video we are going to talk about the IITs and the MBA ecosystem. We are going to compare the IITs on a broad structure on based on pedagogy, course structure, placements, stipends, location, diversity. Sab kuch ke base mein teen IITs ke beech mein hum primarily compare karenge. The top three IITs, IIT Bombay, IIT Delhi and IIT Kharagpur. IIT Kanpur is also doing pretty well and the other IITs are also picking up pace like IIT Madras but we are not going to keep them into the conversation because we are not well conversant with them. Uh, the three IITs that are in the spotlight as of now for doing an MBA course, uh, I am going to compare the three IITs uh, based on these parameters. I didn't have video in the video, sorry for that, I was stuck in some personal chaos but this video is a much requested video from the subscribers and viewers so I will go straight away to the video. So, IITs के बीच में जब comparison कर रहे हैं पहले ही मैंने बोल दिया कि मैं तीन IITs को pick up करूँगा primarily जो placement के तौर पे ROI के तौर पे सब कुछ के तौर पे top three दिख रहे हैं अभी primary analysis में लोग बोल सकते हैं IIT कानपुर का ROI is excellent I do agree it is brilliant but still top three IITs का जब नाम आता है MBA course के लिए तो ये ही तीन IITs आते हैं IIT Delhi IIT Bombay and IIT खड़कपुर so uh, you may not know them uh, by their MBA course school name like SJM, SOM, IIT Bombay very popular uh, SJ Mehta School of Management SJM, SOM uh, similarly IIT Delhi ka hai DMS uh, that is Department of Management Studies uh, IIT Delhi and uh, in IIT Kharagpur it is called the VGSOM Vinod Gupta School of Management it is an affiliated uh, institute within IIT Kharagpur you get a degree from IIT Kharagpur itself it is a department that performs uh, uh, within IIT Kharagpur so is MBA from IIT worth doing is first question that will come to your mind right I have a separate video I am a byproduct myself I have done my MBA from IIT Kharagpur VGSOM IIT Kharagpur uh, and I am doing well in my life at least I would love to believe so if you think I am and there are multiple examples who are doing pretty well with their life after doing an MBA from IITs uh, you can definitely consider their example and you can pursue an MBA from the IIT bohot bohot acha course hai um, IITs maybe and uh, not very popular in terms of uh, you know uh, so called uh, brand name or tag but uh, equally well performing as compared to the IIMs or other institutes like FMS, SPJ and MDI, Gurgaon, XLRI. Bohut sare comparisons hote hai but mein kahunga IITs are no less than these institutes and trust me when I say this I am not giving you a biased opinion it is equally good. Now IITs ka comparison karte hai because that is a separate video that is a separate topic which I have discussed and you can see that video in a separate link altogether but aaj ka comparison ye hai ki IIT Bombay kaisa kar raha hai IIT Delhi kaisa kar raha hai IIT Kharagpur kaisa kar raha hai to agar main placements ke taur pe batau to IIT Bombay to comparison mein nahi aata it is out of the league now it is clocking some 29 lakhs 30 lakhs average LPA package which is almost comparable to the ABC the holy trinity my friends jo hum bolte hai Ahmedabad Bangalore Calcutta IIMs ko IIT Bombay is almost reaching there that's the kind of league it provides it comes in the top 5 top 6 institutes IIT Bombay kudos to you for pulling off the placement seasons brilliantly their lowest package they revealed this year uh, like the year that I passed in was 18 LPA that's like the average for most of the colleges, most of the good MBA colleges, but they are closing their lowest there. So absolutely phenomenal in terms of placements and IIT Delhi and Kharagpur uh, comes nowhere nearby when it comes to the placement. If placement, because placement mein log sabse interested in placement, I told placement ke baad pehle hi bata di um, uh, IIT Delhi, uh, according to the figures that they have provided, they have, they have closed somewhere around 22, 24 and uh, according to IIT Kharagpur, it is somewhere around 20, 21, 22 lakhs. So all Almost comparable IIT Delhi and IIT Kharagpur mein bolunga because variable component bohut sare companies mein vary karte hai. Ultimately at the end of the day your in hand salary, take home salary or fixed component if I say to be specific almost remains at par uh, in both the institutes. So comparable IIT Delhi and IIT Kharagpur but IIT Bombay leagues apart. IIT Bombay doing pretty well for itself in terms of placements and stipends in summer internships. Now uh, hum aajate ki placement 100% bachcho ka hota hai ki nahi. See uh, Delhi claim karta hai 100% बच्चों का होता है, Bombay claim करते हैं 100% बच्चों का होता है, IIT खड़कपुर में तो मैं खुद ही evidence हूँ हमारे batch में या हमारे पिछले batch में भी 100% placement हुआ है, so in terms of placement percentage whether all of the people will get placed or not uh, at par I would say all the three institutes because all of them register almost 100% 
प्लेसमेंट सो परसेंटेज प्लेसमेंट में कोई दिक्कत नहीं है अगर हम अगले टॉपिक में आ जाए पेडागॉग एंड को स्ट्रक्चर यहाँ पे डिफरेंस आ जाता है थोड़ा बहुत दोस्तों क्योंकि जहां तक मेरे को पता है कॉलेजेस का स्ट्रक्चर या मैंने खुद करा हुआ है वीजी सोम का कोर्स आई थिंक वीजी सोम हैज अ वेरी वेरी एनालिटिक्स ड्रिवन अप्रोच मेड बी डेटा मार्केटिंग एनालिटिक्स मेड बी ऑपरेशन एनालिटिक्स मेड बी सप्लाई चेन एनालिटिक्स बट अ वेरी डेटा एनालिटिक्स ड्रिवन अप्रोच वेर एज द अदर कॉलेजेस आई फील and not that heavy on data analytics because i have interacted with those folks as well i have studied their curriculum as well iit bombay is that one college jahan pe companies are mostly operations driven so unka core structure bhi thoda operations driven hota hai the kind of um, degree that you get at iit kharagpur is general management which will co- cover all the facets of uh, um, mba so that i think in a generalistic way is a much uh, better approach and data analytics being the talk of the town these days that is a strong point that iit kharagpur is having over iit delhi and bombay iit delhi and bombay pretty sure i am they are also focusing on data analytics but agar main unka companies dekho the type of companies that they host and the course and curriculum structure and after an interaction with their folks only their courses are more driven towards operations whereas in iit kharagpur the perception that it is driven towards operations is not absolutely right it is more driven towards data analytics and extended data इंजीनियरिंग सो अगर आप उस तरफ देख रहे हो तो मे बी आई डी खड़गपुर इज द राइट प्लेस फॉर यू आई डी बॉम्बे ऑन द अदर हैंड अगर मैं नीटी मुंबई के बाद अगर मैं बोलूंगा नीटी मुंबई इज द मेक्का ऑफ ऑपरेशन एज ए कॉलेज अगर उसके बाद कोई कॉलेज में बोलूंगा ना कि नीटी मुंबई के बाद कोई कॉलेज है ऑपरेशन में तो दैट इज गुड बी आई डी बॉम्बे दैट्स देर फोटे दैट्स देर स्ट्रेंथ ऑपरेशन एंड सप्लाई चेन सिमिलरली आई डी दिल्ली का भी सिमिलर काइंड ऑफ स्ट्रक्चर है मिक्सड है इट्स सम अमाउंट ऑफ डेटा एनालिटिक्स अमाउंट ऑफ मार्केटिंग सम अमाउंट ऑफ ऑपरेशन for id kharagpur it is mostly de- driven towards data analytics and that's the kind of roles that also come data analytics data analytics consultancies and uh, something that has uh, to do something with the data driven approach it is more of a coding more of learning programming languages and how to solve real life management problems using those tools so that is the kind of approach or pedagogy or core structure agar main bolu uh, teachers Uh, again uh, i cannot uh, you know judge the merit of these teachers but mostly iit bombay se hi iit kharagpur mein aayenge iit kharagpur se iit delhi mein jayenge so these are interchangeable so i would again say at par iit bombay delhi and kharagpur sabke teachers at par hai iit bombay ka thoda mere ko lagta hai faculty shayad behtar ho sakta hai um, matlab ho sakta hai in the sense hai uh, currently the faculty that they are having they are hosting is a little better than the other two institutes but uh, having said that i think almost at par all the three students in terms of uh, the the teacher uh, uh, of the of the professors uh, but again i am no good to judge the merit of the professor so i won't be able to i won't be able to comment much on that but pedagogy or course structure there is a big difference uh, now uh, coming to the diversity part of it again diversity in iits is a difficult thing to find at least in terms of gender diversity and academic diversity you won't find it that much but uh, the iits are also amping up their pace in inclusion of diversity uh, in terms of gender diversity particularly एंड एकेडमिक डाइवर्सिटी में उतना नहीं है जहां तक मेरे को पता है तीनों आई में एट पार है वंस अगेन दीज आर एट पार इन टर्म्स ऑफ लोकेशन बेस्ड एडवांटेज माय फ्रेंड्स नाउ देखिए कोविड के पहले ना एच आर यूज टू कम ऑन कैंपस आई टी खड़गपुर डिड एंड स्टैंड अ चांस बॉस बिकॉज वी आर लोकेटेड इन अ रिमोट पार्ट ऑफ द कंट्री सो इफ यू गो टू कैलकटा इट्स अ थ्री आवर्स ट्रेवल फ्रॉम कैलकटा टू खड़गपुर सो हार्डली रिक्रूटर्स वुड कम देयर hardly recruiters would be on the campus but id delhi and id bombay due to their locational advantage would have an amp up uh, on the placement scenario but given that the situations have turned the tables have turned around and actually it is a more of an online recruitment process um, companies have stopped spending on going to campuses and hiring them um, i don't know if in the near future uh, there will be a change in this behavior will they start coming to campuses again then locationally id kharagpur is, is at a disadvantage compared to id bombay and delhi but as long as the online placements are going on uh, there stands no difference so they are at par currently but if you talk about the future if the company start hiring again on campus recruitment processes uh, if they start doing then id bombay and uh, uh, delhi clearly stands apart and clearly stands out from id kharagpur so primarily and lastly 
I would say, talk about the fees. I forgot to talk about the fees. The fee structure in IIT Bombay is pretty expensive. Like their placements are brilliant. The fees are also a little expensive. So ROI again, in terms of ROI, it remains at par because probably a person would be getting an average of 29 and they would be pay, spending an average of 18 to 20 lakhs. I don't know. Last time I studied uh, their fee structure, it was around 15 to 16 lakhs, but they have probably increased that. They have made it around 18 to 20 lakhs. So the ROI again remains 1.7 to 1.8 whereas for um, IIT Kharagpur and IIT Delhi if you see IIT Delhi has the best ROI in terms of ROI they are the best college I think they charge some 8 to 10 lakh bucks and uh, they have an average salary of 24, 23, 24 so their ROI is more than two times uh, for IIT Kharagpur the charges are somewhere around 10 lakhs and the average is around uh, 21, 20, 21 then again uh, almost 2, 2.1 in terms of ROI Delhi is IIT Delhi is doing the best right now uh, in terms of average package divided by the fees because the fees is the least in IID Delhi uh, compared to that IID Kharagpur is the second best but IID Bombay is not catching up pace there but in the long term if you're starting with a base of 29 then you are uh, you know you are aiming for success so uh, definitely in terms of uh, salaries IID Bombay is doing pretty well but in terms of fees they are pretty high they are almost double the fees that IID Delhi and Bombay uh, IID Delhi and Kharagpur are charging right now uh, so in that term ID uh, Delhi and ID Kharagpur stands a better position. Also, for SCST people, uh, the uh, the tuition fees is waived off, so they are studying it, uh, studying the course at basically two three lakh rupees, which makes the ROI almost ten times in ID Kharagpur. I can at least say for that. So in that sense, it's a win-win opportunity uh, over the other IIMs or the other colleges where there is no such uh, scheme that is available for SCST in particular. It's a win-win opportunity to join any IIT. So that's an over overall comparison in terms of uh, placement scenario, in terms of fees, in terms of pedagogy or course structure, in terms of locational advantage and in terms of diversity. So almost at par in certain scenarios, but fairly different in others like pedagogy, like course structure, uh, like um, fees, uh, like locational advantages, they are fairly different from each other. So that's a detailed analysis now given these scenarios where you're interested what you want to do and how much salary or fees are you looking forward to is your call that you have to take see in the long run the salary is just a figure it definitely gives you a starting base as i told you nothing better than that but apart from that you will have to find your own interest if your interest doesn't lie in operations if it lies in data analytics then ID Kharagpur is the place for you. If it lies in marketing, probably ID Delhi is the place for you. We never know. But your interest is one very important factor, my friends. You will have to identify that and take your decision based on that factor. Are you ready to spend 16, 18 lakhs? Are you comfortable with the fees of IIT Bombay? Maybe not. Are you comfortable with the fees of IIT Delhi? Maybe yes. Then ID Delhi is the place for you. Uh, because eventually you know that you will amp up from 22 to you know 29 in probably one year or two years of time by switching opportunities or staying in the company and getting promoted so it's just a matter of time but fees initially becomes a big burden even if you take loans the interest rates are extremely high nowadays so all of these factors combined together you are the one who will take the decision for yourself i was just there to give the analysis that was it that was a much requested video thank you for watching if you are watching till the end and if you like the video like it share it with your friends subscribe to the channel because we bring on more contents like this on this channel hit the bells icon for regular updates so that you get updated every time we bring a video jab bhi hum video lay, aapko updates mil jaye. That's it from my side for today. Thank you very much.